Hi, okay, so we are back again with um, some car coaching and um, it's a lovely um, sunny day and um, so I thought I'd take this opportunity to make the video that I had promised you all and by the way there is a bonus coming to you guys which definitely look out for it is uh, a very special a uh, little interview I did with uh, Dr. Di Martini on the subject of um, so-called affairs uh, that will be coming out uh, soon and um, but I thought I'll do this video based on you know a status I put up a little while ago around if you wanted me to talk about um, loyalty uh, in friendship and you know relationships and you know, I was seeing basically a lot of statuses around um, that, you know, loyalty is the number one thing and, oh, you know, when you're in distress, you get to see who your loyal friends are and, um, you know, other things like, uh, yeah, basically the best thing you can give someone is your loyalty and honestly speaking, I used to think exactly the same way. Um, I used to really be um, distressed uh, when people weren't in my perception loyal to me or my friendship or I found I was doing a lot for other people and in my perception they weren't being loyal to me by being there for me. Um, a lot of this just used to run me until I really studied and understood uh, human behavior. And here's the truth, right? When I now read some of those things, I really have a check-in with myself and uh, some of you might be offended by what I'm about to say but I I do go what a load of shit now because I understand what human behavior is what drives us and nobody is ever loyal to you whether that be in your friendship whether that be people working for you whether that be um, in relationship uh, even in and, and that's even true in like families right because families don't speak to each other don't uh you know they break up um when their highest priorities are challenged and that's the same thing with you know jobs and the same thing with relationships we all have a hierarchy of priorities right and we're going to interact with those people who we perceive are going to fulfill those it's that is the bottom line and in fact this is the crux of all human behavior um, and the Greeks recognized the fact that we all operate on this uh, what I call the GPS the Greeks clearly didn't call it the GPS uh, the Greeks called it axiology the study of axiology which is the study of values um, and worth which is basically what are our human values and that is not honesty integrity and loyalty these are all moral values that have been imposed onto us because we're going to be loyal and disloyal, honest and dishonest, uh, you know, lie and tell the truth based on what we perceive is going to give us uh, more advantage over disadvantage, more reward over risk in our highest priorities. And I tell you, like, I, I say this with the most amount of love. When you understand this, you liberate yourself from this illusion that people are going to live according to your priorities or they're going to be loyal to you because you say so um it doesn't work like that you know if if you have a set of priorities and you are able to communicate those in somebody else's priorities they're going to be so-called loyal to you but if you're not able to communicate in that you can forget it and you know people are going to go searching elsewhere um you know it's it it's the key thing that i want people to understand is there is no such thing as loyalty to you there is only loyalty to a human um hierarchy of priorities that's all people are loyal to and that's all you can expect them to be anytime you see yourself shooting on other people and saying you know you should be there for me and you should be loyal to me that's you imposing your own priorities on them and if you beat yourself up and think you know i should be loyal to them or i should be doing this 
know that you're injecting somebody else's priorities into them and anytime you expect yourself to live outside of your own priorities or somebody else to live outside of their priorities you are going to experience all different types of emotions from anger and aggression blame and betrayal cri uh, criticism and challenge now my phone decides to ring um, despair and depression right so let me just define that so any of those a b c d's of negativity come into our life when we are expecting unrealistic expectations from our life basically right so um this is crazy like my my, my music wouldn't go on because it's with Spotify and a little bit of Michael one of my favorite songs love is a feeling he says right and it's so true because when you see that you have somebody that is both challenging and supporting you in your highest priorities that's what true love is love is not someone being loyal to you which is this illusion that we have and you know for me it's so um, inspiring to actually teach people the truth because I've been there I've been there and lived the illusion um, for this specific topic doesn't mean I'm not in an illusion in other areas but this specific topic and I truly um, you know liberated myself when I understood it and and, and also saw how I show up now in relationships I know that in a friendship in a relationship in my in my work environment if I'm not able to communicate in someone's priorities they're not loyal to me it's as simple as that and you're not flipping loyal to anyone else but your own priorities let's get that straight so when you see those kind of posts or whatever um, question yourself like really ask yourself is this true I think you will um, have a different stance on certain things after my uh, car coaching video on uh, loyalty I hope that was of value to you and sure I'm gonna have people that are gonna go oh but that's ridiculous that's okay um, it, you're just not ready for this information right now that's how I see it I, I know that you know years ago I wasn't ready to believe this or you know whatever way but you know believing the illusion I kind of was doing all that distress and I asked myself how's that working out for me living in this illusion and when I saw it doesn't work out for me I decided to embrace the truth the choice is yours too so um, anyway I hope that was helpful <laughs>